It's Craftsman Launch Week as Stanley Black & Decker stay busy filling the market with new tools. Southwire grows its business again as Milwaukee continues to roll out products from NPS 18. It's our 21st episode. Does that mean our show can legally drink? I feel like this show's been drinking for quite a while now. Touche. It's Friday, mm -hmm. August 17th. This is your Copsville Week in Review. It's new product launch week for Craftsman, who just introduced over 1,200 new tools and products at their event this week in Baltimore, Maryland, including a new cordless circular saw, cordless nailers, 20 volt drills, and impact hammers, a reciprocating saw, and apparently a high performance sports car. Rob Robillard, the Concord Carpenter from Toolbox Buzz, shared a great photo of the new Craftsman 20 volt cordless drill and Tools in Action live streamed the entire opening presentation on YouTube if you'd like to sit in on the action. No word just yet on which of these 1,200 tools will be available at Lowe's, Ace Hardware, Amazon, or at decomposing Sears Hardware stores, but stay tuned for more updates as they become available. You can follow the updates for yourself at the hashtag CraftsmanLaunch. OPE Reviews gave us a great look at Craftsman's expanded outdoor power equipment at the event, including a number of new gas and battery powered tools. They showed off the new 60 volt electric chainsaw and mower and a lot more. They also announced updated models of their riding, zero turn and walk behind mowers. Craftsman hopes that just thinking about all these new tools will keep you warm through the winter and the plans to deliver all these new toys just in time for spring. Travis at Tools by Design shared an image on Instagram that shows all six of the Stanley Black & Decker drill brands and battery platforms. While Metabo and other European tools are moving towards a universal battery platform in the cordless alliance system, Stanley Black & Decker is moving in the opposite direction, adding the Craftsman 20 volt to their already robust lineup of five other brands. Perhaps we could applaud Stanley Black & Decker for celebrating diversity amongst their own lineup but even bleeding heart liberals might say that this is far too many battery platforms for one manufacturer. Go check out the lineup for yourself at Tools by Design on Instagram. This week, Southwire, makers of fine electrical tools, equipment, and cabling, announced that they have acquired Illinois-based Garvin Industries. Garvin is a 120-year-old manufacturer of electrical lighting and low-voltage products, and Southwire stated that this acquisition helps the company meet their goal of growing by 50% over the next five years. Garvin offers fully customizable orders and boasts over 3,000 electrical products available online, all shipping same day if ordered by 2 p.m., which is great unless your parts guy regularly sleeps in until around 2.30, in which case you're screwed. Summer's almost over, which means it's just about time to shut down your pool for the season. So if you've been considering purchasing a Ryobi underwater pool vacuum to help clean it out before throwing that cover on it, the team at Tools in Action enlisted John Miller to give you a full review. Apparently John's just out of the witness protection program and ready to dive right into a detailed overview of the Ryobi's features while his dog swims laps in the background. If you're comfortable taking advice from a faceless man or you simply just love canine aquatics, go check out Tools in Action on YouTube. Two very cool guys on YouTube, Jimmy DeResta and Eric at Hand Tool Rescue, teamed up for a complete massive restoration of a 1940s Delta bandsaw. It's a fascinating project that required fabrication of replacement parts and a lot of rust removal. If you want to go behind the scenes of the restoration process, you can find it at Hand Tool Rescue on YouTube, or if you really are hardcore and want to go behind the scenes of the behind the scenes, you'll want to catch Duress's video as well. Both channels are streaming 24-7 on YouTube. We love that restoration, but our project of the week is brought to us by Jackman Works, who, with the aid of a Jimmy Diresta oversized razor blade, posted a video on YouTube this week of his process for creating a giant box cutter, created completely out of wood. Filled with the slick camera work and music, while free of bothersome narration for the first 13 minutes, the video concludes with Jackman opening a package from the U.S. Postal Service, completely blowing the mind of his mail carrier. Well done, sir. Go check it out at Jackman Works on YouTube. I've got a secret. Someone is going to launch an enormous power tool contest coming out this Tuesday. I know what you're thinking. How enormous? Well, ooh, I can't tell you. You're lucky I'm even telling you it's gonna happen this Tuesday but you don't have to miss out. Take a moment to subscribe to our channel and click the bell. 
Why? Well, because we'll be announcing the contest right here on Cop Tool. So if you are subscribed and you click the bell, you'll be notified the minute we announce the biggest Power Tool giveaway we have ever seen. Man, I love having secrets. Moving on to contests we can tell you about, it's contest time. The fellows over at Toolbox Buzz continue to hand out Tradesman of the Month awards, and July's winner was Eddie Hillman, an Air Force vet and electrician at Freeman's Electrical Service. You've still got two weeks left to apply for August, so make sure you apply at ToolboxBuzz.com. Other ongoing contests this month include Ryobi's Addicted to DIY Challenge, where you can win $500 in Ryobi Power Tools, and Pro Tool Reviews is giving away one 10-inch rigid dust bevel miter saw. I don't even know. Go check out the links below. All right, guys, that's it for our 21st episode. Congratulations to Jonathan Weeb for winning last week's giveaway for a 70-piece Crescent Mechanics tool set from OhioPowerTool.com. This week we're giving away a Milwaukee M18 Gen 3 impact driver, and that's complete with a 5 amp hour battery and an M18 charger and a bag. You've just got to be a fan to win. So simply subscribe to this channel and leave a comment below to be entered. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next week.